In this tutorial, I'll show you how to republish or repurpose your blog post on medium.com. So as you can tell here, I have a new blog website and these are blogs I have on it. But because this website is new, it doesn't have high domain authority. So I want to leverage the medium.com domain power or domain authority to promote this website. And by the way, if you are new to medium.com, I have a bunch of tutorials on how to use this platform to promote your products, your affiliate links and your blog website site in general i'll drop the link in the description box all right so let me close it and let's continue all right so there are two ways of doing this and i'll show you how i'll click on my avatar click on stories all right then you click on import the story now so what i'm gonna do let's say if i want to promote this one i'll just right click and copy the link okay come back here Control v to drop it all right then i'll click import it's gonna import everything off this blog post okay but i don't want to do that you know why when you do that it's gonna backdate from the exact day that i published this blog post and the way medium algorithm works is that they prioritize new blog posts so for instance if i publish it today it's not gonna use today's date it's gonna use the dates that i published this blog post meaning to them this blog post is old so we don't want to use that route i'll show you the other way around okay so i will delete delete this to my avatar again then click on write a story okay so right here i'll go back to my blog post and i want to republish this or repurpose this blog post so i'll click on it all right it's about shopify and highlight everything okay highlight everything all the way to the end don't worry about anything okay up to here and i'll right click copy go back here click on the title control v control v works better with this system all right so as you can tell i'm missing all the images you know sometimes these things happen normally it should import everything so i will delete Control a delete and i'll do it one more time so i'll copy everything once again Control c to copy then click here on the title then Control v to paste and let's see this time around okay all right so this time it works and i'll go up here and close the gap all right so let's see which picture is missing all right so group the global comments platform and the should prepare pricing okay all right i have this one there let's see this one okay the pricing okay so let's see let me right click copy image on your horizon all right so click here and drop it or the system okay now it works normally this should work the first time you copy the entire post and drop it so if it doesn't work this is what you have to do okay so let's go back let me see if there's one more thing i'm missing okay so i guess that's it all right so let's see okay i'll keep it like this all right now we have to edit it all right so now we have to modify this blog post because with medium.com they don't like too much linking all right and you don't have to be salesy or stuff like that okay so let me scroll down see this first link i will have to unlink it so unlink all right they don't like that when you are linking too much actually let me let me take off this link as well and i'll keep this one okay so i'll scroll down i don't want to link too much so i'll scroll down and make sure all right so let me just take this off actually let me check something yeah the garbage is all right so this time i will take off this okay and by the way this is not the direct affiliate link i have redirected it through bitly okay so this is all right but at the same time i will try to issue affiliate disclaimer so this is something you have to include okay even though this is not a direct affiliate link i would like to issue a disclaimer okay just to be on the safer side just to avoid problems okay because per the medium guidelines you need to include affiliate disclaimer whenever you have link directing people to an affiliate website but in this case when people click it it's technically redirecting them to bitly.com but within a fraction of a sec they'll be going to the affiliate site so technically when they click on it they are going straight to the affiliate page so it's always good to issue the disclaimer okay but at the same time because this is redirecting i can decide to take off this 
okay without running into problems because like i said earlier on the link is not going straight to shopify we have is going to where bitly okay so all right so let's see but for some reason i think i have too much so let's see i have one here i have two i have three and the last one four so you know what there should be one under the pricing which i have it i have to delete this one because it's gonna be too much okay and this one is okay this one is okay okay i'll keep it like that and close the guy up here okay all right so but like i said earlier on i would like to include the affiliate disclosure just to be on the safer side so Control c to copy go back click down here sorry and Control v to paste it so now click on this plus sign and add the brick line okay just to make it look nice all right so this is the way it's supposed to be but you don't have to worry about this if you don't have links okay so next we have to publish it so click publish all right so now i have to tag this blog post just so medium can show it to the right people so shopify so shopify okay uh online business okay so it's online business is uh 28 online shopping and online marketing so i guess i'll go with this one online marketing business the business also is good and i'll say online online store okay online store builder okay this is good but it doesn't have enough views per month so online store i'll go with this then let's see website okay websites or website design i'll go with the website okay mm, actually i'll go with marketing i'll go with marketing yeah marketing is better all right so meter your stories all right so i like to earn money when members read this blog post okay send a link to your email subscribers that's obvious i will check that too then the last thing you need to do is to publish it okay all right so this is how it looks after publish okay okay now i need to show you what you need to do next okay you have to do this if you don't do it you're gonna run into trouble okay so click on this menu then click on uh, story setting all right so scroll down and click on advanced settings under customized canonical link click this checkbox all right so now i need to get the original blog post link so double click highlight right click copy go back to medium and click here right click and paste it click on save all right so by doing this you are informing google that this story was originally published elsewhere okay now what i'll do next which is optional but i like doing that is to go back to the link uh go back to the story click on it click on edit one more time edit story then scroll down then right here okay, right here click on it and type originally originally published on okay let me get the site name copy not the blog post link okay just the website link then drop it here all right take off the forward slash save and publish so this is the right way to do it originally published on this website this blog post is new that's exactly what you want all right so this is how you republish your blog posts so leveraging the medium domain authority thanks for your time please don't forget to like comment and subscribe to this channel